Hey there, electricity enthusiasts. Welcome back to Electricity Frenzy, your go-to channel for all things electrical. I'm your host, and today, we've got an electrifying topic to discuss. Can low voltage damage your beloved hair dryer? Let's dive in and find out. So, you're probably wondering if using a hair dryer with low voltage can spell disaster for your trusty beauty tool. Well, let's start by understanding what voltage is. Voltage is the electrical pressure that powers our devices. In the USA, the standard voltage for household outlets is typically 120 volts. However, in some situations, you might encounter low voltage scenarios. This can happen due to several reasons, such as heavy electrical loads in your area, old wiring, or even during power outages when generators are supplying power. Now, let's get to the real question, can low voltage damage your hair dryer? The answer is, well, a bit nuanced. Hair dryers are designed to operate within a specific voltage range, usually around 110 to 125 volts. So, if the voltage drops below this range, it could potentially lead to problems. Inside your hair dryer, there's a motor and heating element. The motor is responsible for spinning the fan that blows air, while the heating element raises the temperature of the air. Both components require a stable voltage to function properly. Now, if the voltage is too low, the motor might not receive enough power to spin the fan effectively, causing weaker airflow. It might take ages to dry your luscious locks, and ain't nobody got time for that. And the heating element? Well, low voltage can lead to reduced heat output, which means it'll take longer to dry your hair. Plus, the inconsistent power supply might put extra stress on the motor and heating element, potentially shortening their lifespan. But, fret not. There are a couple of things you can do to protect your hair dryer and ensure it keeps working like a charm. Firstly, invest in a good quality voltage regulator or stabilizer. These nifty devices can stabilize voltage fluctuations and safeguard your hair dryer from potential harm. Secondly, consider using your hair dryer during hours when the power demand is lower in your area. This can help prevent voltage drops during peak times, ensuring your hair dryer gets the juice it needs. So, there you have it, electricity enthusiasts. While low voltage can potentially cause problems for your hair dryer, with a little caution and the right tools like a voltage regulator or stabilizer, you can keep your hair looking fabulous without any worries. Thanks for tuning in to Electricity Frenzy. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and consider subscribing for more electrifying content. Remember to stay safe and informed about all things electricity. Until next time, keep those hair dryers running and have a shocking day. Bye for now.